Hello, student. This question is from the UPSC 2024 examination. And the question is on the calendar. The calendar for the year 2025 is same form. Means the question is asking that 2025 calendar is year ke calendar ke same hoga. So this is an easy question. This question we can do in two ways. The first one is the very direct way. Kisi bhi year ka, non leap year, the any non leap year calendar will be repeated either at the 6th year or the 11th year. Yeah, to 6 saal ke baad repeat hoga, ya phir wo 11 saal ke baad repeat hoga. Let's see here, if we are saying after the 2025, the calendar will be repeated after the 6th year, means next year will be 2031. Or if it's repeating after the 11th year, then it will be the 2036. It two conditions possible ho sakti hai, either after the 6th year or after the 11 year. If the 6th year mein karega 2031, then the 11 year mein 2036. So let's check the option now. 2029 nahi hoga, 2030 nahi hoga, 31 is the option and 33 we nahi hoga. So the answer is C here. The answer of this question is C. So this is a simple method how to check which year will be the same of the previous year. 2025 ke similar koon sa hoga. Now, let's come to the second way to solve this question. There is a, like a traditional way to solve this question also. In a leap year, in a leap year, there is a two odd days. And in a known leap year, known leap year are those years, where there are 365 days. And leap year are those years, where there are 366 days. Hote if I am dividing the 365 by 7, I am getting the 1 remainder. If I am dividing the 366 by the 7, I am getting the 2 remainders. So this 2 and 1, 1 odd days and the 2 odd days respectively in the known leap year and the leap year. So now let's count here. From 2025, 1 odd day, it's a uh, known leap year. 2026 is also a known leap year, 1 odd day. 2027 is also a known leap year, 1 odd day. 2028 is a leap year, so it's a two odd days. Similarly, we can write the 2029 is a known leap year, one odd days, 2030 will be a known leap year, one odd day. If I'm adding one, two, three, five, six, seven, I'm getting the complete week divided is zero. Means the next year, 2031, will be the same as the year 2025, having the single odd day at what is in the 2025. So it is proved by the both the method. The 2025 ke baad, the same year repeat hoga, wo 2031 ka hoga. So we can do the question by the two methods here. So at Educami, we are going to start the CSET classes at the 15th of September to know the different methods. Easy tarikhe se kaise solve kar sakte hain. Kaise question ko direct dekh ke answer bhi bata sakte hain. Without formula, kaise question ko solve karenge. So we are going to do all these methods in the CSET examination. Thank you.